Okay, me and Amy are going on a daddy-daughter walk. Exercise, little exercise. Uh, our ensembles that we are wearing, I have on all black, except for my working shoes, which I had on this morning. So, I was wearing this while I was working in the yard. You know, black is very slimming. Black makes you look thinner. Probably look a lot thinner. I normally look in the video because um, I'm wearing all black. While we were while we were on our way, we saw a guy cross the road, and he was he was running, and he was running. He didn't use his arms. He didn't use his arms. He was just running his legs, and his little arms were he was, weird. He was too busy holding his cigarette with his arms. Yeah, but I would have put the cigarette in my, in my mouth, mouth and ran. <laughs> Cigarette. I had a cigarette. It's okay. We Amy, can't. do we need to tell them your cigarette story? No. <laughs> no, we do not. I don't smoke cigarettes. <laughs> I would like when, to provoke my parents. <laughs> when when I was little. Was really little. How old were you? I don't know. I don't remember this at all we because were in I was the so car. young. Is another time we were in the car. We were on the way to church. She's always on the way to church when she would <laughs> tell us these stories. And Amy, all of a sudden, out of nowhere, goes, I found it. I tasted a cigarette. <laughs> we're like, you tasted a cigarette? And usually we would ignore her when she would say these things, but this one, we often, you tasted a cigarette? Where did you taste a cigarette? Where did you get a cigarette at? So we start asking her all these questions about the cigarette. And uh, we said, well, where was it? Where did you find a cigarette? And she said, in the bathroom. And I'm like, the bathroom? Where? And she said, at Stars and Strikes, which is a, uh, it's a bowling, bowling place. alley. You know, basically a bowling alley. And so we were like, oh, my God, did you put it in your mouth? You didn't, I mean, did you taste it? She was like, yeah. And, she, and then she could tell we were all upset. I guarantee you that I did not taste that cigarette. And she goes... If I had a fire, I would have fired it. <laughs> she said she would have fired it. <laughs> but she didn't have a lighter, so I guess she couldn't fire the... If I'd have had a fire. <laughs> she'd have had a fire. She could have started a fire. I, she I she would have fired, fired the cigarette. Oh, my God. Show them your face. You no. need them to see your face. This girl... <laughs> probably licked a cigarette on the floor... And they'd probably ask some. I just didn't want to go to and church. She was so little. She was in a car seat when she told. <laughs> she was in a car seat when she told us this story. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> you should be sorry. That's a horrible thing to do to your parents. I hope there's no cigarette butts on this trail, <laughs> or tobacco cans, I will or tobacco pick them pouches, up. or anything. She'll be, she'll be tasting them. I will pick them up. I'm kidding. I don't want to pick them up. There's a town car even older than ours. <laughs> that is an old town car. Yes, box. sir. So Amy just told me that the people in Georgia are bad drivers. Compared to the people in Florida. People in Florida are nice drivers. She said the people in Florida are nice drivers. I did get honked at once, but she didn't get honked at in Florida like she gets honked at in Georgia. And she admitted to me that she has been speeding. What speed? Five or ten. Five or ten over the speed limit. Only ten on highways though. Ten on highways. And five everywhere five everywhere else and she doesn't even care that she's speeding she says she may get stopped by the police i don't know what kind of message these people are trying to send here on the silver comet trail obviously people that like mountain views but amy Stop. amy it's a cigarette butt i just told amy about the movie Deliverance. 
while we're out here in the music, out here in the music, while we're out here in the woods, we're not in the music. You can't be in the music. You listen to music, and we're listening for banjo music right now. Amy, you need to get up. There's been some strange things going on here. We saw a herd of squirrels. How many squirrels were there, Amy? Four or five, at least. I think there were more. You gotta learn how to exaggerate. When you tell a story, Amy, you gotta embellish it. Ten, ten. Uh, ten squirrels. And she called me relatively short, which hurt my feelings. Um, so that happened. Uh, and we got passed on a bike by a kind of a Chinese or Korean looking person that had a boom box that was playing Donald Trump, a Donald Trump speech on the, uh, and he was wearing a shirt with a pin protector in the, he had a pocket, like a, you know, like a work shirt, dress shirt. And now we got passed by one of the guys that has the, re the recline, re climb bikes which those are cool I would like to get one of those it'd be like being in a recliner and riding a bicycle all at the same time yes you could call the police ghost nothing you could do about a ghost Amy said the woods are kind of spooky because of all the movies about woods she said that I'm sweaty. We're walking. How are you sweating? There are some. Uh, I was sweating before we even started walking. Um, but there are some kind of spooky sights. And she says that every time she sees a building or a house, she thinks it may be haunted. Woods creep me out. Woods creep me out. And she does not like the skinny bikes. <laughs> so like you skinny bike people that are on the Silver Comet Trail, which is like... 90% of the people, she does not like the skinny bikes. She prefers, what kind of bike do you prefer? No, but which kind of bike do you like? Um, you don't like the ones with the tiny wheels. Just like normal like mountain bikes or whatever. Mountain bikes. You should ride a mountain bike on the Silver Comet Trail. Amy, don't turn around. Do not turn around. We just saw us. We saw a spider. Gross. I don't like spiders. Stop it. It's a spider, Amy. Don't turn around. Don't. There's a spooky shack. Amy, don't turn around. 